Let's review the brand new Heart of Glass by Davinus. If you're new to my channel and if you're not, welcome back. I'm uh, Mike. I'm who I'm a hairdresser, a L'Oreal colour specialist, a makeup fan and a skincare lover. In today's film we are going to be reviewing as well it's going to be my first impressions of the brand new Heart of Glass by Davinus. So if you want to hear my thoughts about this brand new range then you better keep on watching. What is the story everyone? Yet another Davinus film and it's been a minute since I actually done anything about Davinus so I am really really excited and Davinus came out with this brand new range called Heart of Glass but what is Heart of Glass? Heart of Glass is a full hair care range for blonde hair. It's really to highlight the beauty of blonde hair whether it's natural blonde hair or lightened or pre-lightened or coloured blonde hair. And we have four products in the whole entire range. So you guys, let me present you with the first product from Heart of Glass. Heart of Glass Silkening Shampoo. Now you guys, first of all when I heard the name I really thought it's going to be a sickening shampoo but it is a silkening shampoo. And I must say I absolutely adore the packaging, it looks very chic. It looks very expensive, but at the same time, it looks very natural. As we can see, there is minimal plastic used, and that's the whole ethos behind Davinus. The older packaging is designed for minimal use of plastic. We do get 250 ml of product, and this product retails for £20, which is not bad at all. I think for a professional hair care range, I think that is actually really, really good. This shampoo is going to gently cleanse and nourish and add shine to your beautiful, blonde, lovely looking hair. So as we can see on this packaging, it does says that it contains Jagua Blue Extract. So I presume the Jagua Blue Extract is the pigment found in this shampoo. Now let's have a look at it and smell it. So it smells, oh it smells beautiful guys. It's not too heavily perfumed, it's actually a really nice pleasant pleasant smell. So it does have a blue tinge to it. Now. I don't understand why they went with blue because blue neutralizes orange and not yellow so that doesn't really make sense to me but when I was reading more about this product I did find out that this shampoo can be used on the daily so it's not like a purple shampoo that you have to use it only once a week this shampoo can be used every single day or every time you wash your hair and it's gonna make your blonde hair lighter and your warm blondes less warmer so if you have white blonde hair it's going to make it whiter and if you have warm blonde hair it's going to make it less warm so stop the warm hair from going warm. So maybe that was the whole idea of this shampoo being more of an indigo blue than purple because it will work on your orangey blondy hair as well. This shampoo is going to give a very delicate chromatic effect to your hair so will not stain the hair like any other purple shampoo so it's absolutely safe to use it every single time but we're gonna put the shampoo into test. The next product I'll be talking about is Heart of Glass Rich Conditioner. So you guys, the packaging is absolutely beautiful and like that we do get 250 ml of product and this product retails for 23 pounds which I don't think it's bad at all for 250 ml of a conditioner. So what will this conditioner do to your hair? It is a fortifying anti-breakage conditioner that will provide your hair with intense nourishment. And it will also enhance your beautiful blonde hair. And like that we do have the Jagua Blue Extract in it. And the Jagua is actually grown sustainably. So props to you Davinus. So let's open this up. And like that we do have that lovely blue indigo shade in it so let me smell it oh and it smells guys it smells just as beautiful as the shampoo but we also find very interesting ingredients in this conditioner we find the be acidic bond complex that is going to really strengthen the hair protect the hair and repair your damaged hair also we find baoboa seeds in this conditioner baoboa seeds are a botanical alternate to silicones and as you all know i'm all about silicone free so it's nice to see something that is more natural and is used as a silicone and like that boboa seed is going to do what silicone does to your hair so it's going to help manageability it's going to control frizz it's going to nourish the hair 
and smooth the cuticle as well. So overall, I'm living for this range because let's not forget Davin is, is all sulfate paraben and this range is also silicone free. The next product from Heart of Glass I'm going to be talking about is Heart of Glass Intense Treatment. Like that the packaging is really really cute and we only get 150 ml of product and this retails for 20 pounds. And you guys, now it's very interesting to see that the treatment is actually cheaper than the conditioner because most brands retail the treatment for a lot more than the conditioner but like that we do get less but it is actually very good to see that you're paying for the amount of product and not just for the name or the formula itself. But anyways let's get back to the intense treatment. This intense treatment is meant to be used once a week unless you have really really dry and damaged hair use it every time or twice a week and it's gonna reinforce your blonde hair. We also find the B acidic bond extract in this that is gonna help to strengthen and reinforce the hair fiber as well as boboa seeds. And you're meant to leave this mask on for five to 10 minutes and then rinse it off. When the conditioner, you only leave it on for five minutes. So you guys, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go off camera and I'm gonna shampoo my hair using the silkening shampoo from Heart of Glass. And will I use a mask or a conditioner? Right, well, I haven't put a mask in my hair in a very, very long time. So I might actually use a mask today and just really give my blonde streak some nourishment. And then once we're back, we have one more product to talk about. So you guys, see you in five or 10. Right you guys, and we are back after shampooing my hair with, where is it? The Silkening Shampoo by Davinus, and then we use the Heart of Glass Intense Mask. So, treatment. So, what are my thoughts about it? First of all, the shampooing experience was lovely, the shampoo smells gorgeous. Now, I would not consider this as a neutralizing purple shampoo because my hair does not look any more neutralized than it would normally use. Like, I definitely wouldn't use that as a purple shampoo. It's more of a shampoo for an everyday use for blonde hair, but it wouldn't be like a purple, purple shampoo, what it is, blue. And it did not weigh down my hair, and my hair did not feel overly soft after using it, which is a good thing because it does mean that it is strengthened and there is no heavy silicones in it, like they say it's not. When it comes to the treatment, I found the treatment absolutely brilliant. It, my hair feels lovely, it feels really silky, it feels definitely reinforced and stronger. So now overall I am pleased, but like that, I wouldn't say that this range is like a purple neutralizing range. It's not. It's a shampoo with blue pigment that's going to help to maintain your lovely blonde hair. Right, so we have one more product to talk about before blow drying my hair and that product is... Sheer Glaze from Heart of Glass. So this is your thermal leave-in in fluid and we do get 150 ml of product and this product retails for 22 pounds and 50 P. Is it P? God, I really don't know. This product is gonna give you hydration and it will restore the elasticity of the hair fiber because as we all know, the elasticity of the hair fiber is gone when we're lightening or bleaching our hair and it will work as a heat protector as well. This product is also going to help your blow dry to last longer or your style. So let's try it out. Now they say to use between 7 to 15 pumps of this in your hair. I mean, I'm going to use two. I mean, 7 to 15 pumps is a lot. Okay, so let's open this up and... Okay, so here's the consistency of it. And like that, it smells beautiful like the rest of the range. So let me just work that through my hair. Okay, and you know, I'll actually put two more into. And okay, so it doesn't feel heavy in the hair. It doesn't feel like a heavy oil in my hair. It's just a fluid that's gonna help to protect your hair during blow drying, and it's gonna give the hair a bit of control. And it will hydrate the hair fiber. So you guys, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go off camera and we're gonna talk about the whole range. And we're back you guys. So let's talk about everything. Let's talk about my hair. When it comes to the actual color now, 
I would definitely say that this is not 100% neutralizing shampoo and maybe if you're using it with the conditioner you get more of a result of the neutralization but I think my hair looks the same way it did prior to that but like that I've only used it once right so let's talk about the shampoo the shampoo experience was brilliant now one thing I am very very impressed with about this range is that my hair does not feel weighed down even though I used the mask and the mask was absolutely beautiful it did not weigh down my hair and I'm always worried about all those products that are hydrating and repairing for blonde hair that they're gonna weigh my hair down but my hair still feels very natural and like that it's probably due to that that there's no silicone in it and they're using a botanical natural alternative to silicone so now overall my hair feels great it feels really soft it feels really smooth now i must say about the sheer glass the sheer glaze sorry about the sheer glaze that i was afraid that it's going to weigh down my hair and like that it didn't and i must say overall i think it's a hit right so when it comes to Heart of Glass, I do think it's a hit and who would I recommend this range for? I think I would recommend this range for any type of blonde. Now, if your hair is definitely on more sensitized and damaged and brittle side, you would definitely need to use something different that is catering more towards damaged and brittle hair. But if your hair is just blonde and you're highlighting your hair or if you're natural blonde and it needs that bit extra care and loving this range is perfect for you now i will definitely want to try the conditioner and i will try the conditioner with the shampoo see if i'm going to get a better result when it comes to the neutralization but i do like that it has that bluey nice pigment in it and it's not going to stain your blonde hair so you can use it every single day Anyways guys, thank you for watching today's film. I hope you found this film rather interesting, helpful and useful. Please like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. Also check out my other social media. And of course you guys, please, please, please take care. Bye.